up, y'all? Call me at a bad time. Just got back from a run. Give me a minute. Welcome to Simba. Enter into the domain. Normally, we don't have this corralled off, but this is the living room. It's pretty, it's your standard, standard liver, living room, pretty spartan. We have one light, adobe walls, wooden door, furniture from a combi, leather-ish, more or less, and if you notice, it's very low to the ground, and pretty uncomfortable. As far as comfortability goes, it's not that good. This is our table. It never really gets used. It's usually over there where the beds now are. There's about 25 people here in Simbal, family visiting for the fiestas here. Light, like I said, beds. Television. me to the bathroom. It's a bit dark. There's only about four light bulbs in the entire house. This, the bathroom leaves something to be desired. It, take a, take a peek, almost just ate it. You have your sink. You have your, your ball days. For the, uh, to hold the water, to store the water when there's no water. It's a poor flush toilet. You have the toilet right there. Um, it's pretty much just a ceramic pot. There's toilet paper. There is a shower head. Very cold showers. By cold, I mean freezing. And then we got the toothbrushes for the little girls. They've just recently started brushing their teeth. And like I said, the sink. And the smell in here, it's musty. It's really... It's not pleasant. Ceilings are pretty low. Ceilings are made of bamboo, wood, and a bit of adobe. Follow me to the kitchen. You'll notice Teddy, the production manager, doing production things. Pretty standard. Right here you have the hallway to the kitchen. You've got the sink where we wash clothing. You have the grandmother walking up from the chickens with a sack of potatoes. Grandma, que dice? La abuela? Strongest woman I've ever met in my life. Literally. Chops wood, wakes at five, carries big sacks on her back. Incredible. Oh my god. I think... I think a cooey's been smushed. I think, I think the cooey's dead. That doesn't happen normally. That's, that's, that's a new thing. You have the chickens down here. You can see them. Yeah, well, it's dead. Such is the life of a cooey here in Peru. Okay, follow me into the kitchen. You'll notice how illuminated it is. Thank you, Mom and Dad. Those are from the Calaminas that we bought them for Christmas. Here you have the kitchen. You have my little host sister Lily. She's a bit shy. She's a bit shy right now. You have the fridge. The stove. And the best part of the kitchen, the family. 
es mejor parte del, de la cocina es la familia Follow me outside to check the view of the surroundings. What is Simbal? Standard desert mountains. There's this new cell phone tower right up there for Claro Mobile. And then you got the mountains over here, which this is where the sun sets. And sometimes, if I'm lucky, it's really, really pretty. It's not twice a week that there's a really, really nice sunset. This is where I spend a lot of my time thinking, working, sleeping. Today, as everybody could attest, there was a marching band at about 6 o'clock, banging drums, blowing on their horns. I'm pretty sure they only did it outside this room and then kept on walking. Very strange thing, but come on in. You'll notice Kelsey on the computer, <laughs> Mac and on the MacBook. Pretty standard, you have your bed, small bed, twin bed. I'm the only room in the house with cement floors. I feel very fortunate to have that. You'll notice this facade has cement. The guy wasn't tall enough to reach the top, so that's still Adobe. Pretty standard. A desk. My clothes, all the clothes I'll need for two years, plus what's hanging up there. This is my chair. Probably my most prized possession is this chair I bought with the moving in allowance. I spent a lot of time here reading, playing the guitar, figuring out ways to save the world right here. I got my games. This is the blanket Booby used last night to sleep in this chair because we had a little slumber party. It was myself. Booby, Teddy, the production manager, and Kelsey. We all had a big slumber party for the fiestas here. These are the games I bought for the school. Uno, Monopoly. They couldn't really grasp Monopoly, and as Booby and Teddy can attest to, the board kind of sucks. It's missing a lot of money pieces. It's not the best Monopoly board. You get what you pay for. It's like 10 soles. And then we got this. The kids love this. It's got chess, ajedrez, damas, checkers. Um, they love this stuff. That's, that's pretty much the extent. Oh yeah. And then right here, zoom in on this. You have the incense and candles, and this is to mitigate the smell from my neighbor, the chancho, the pig. It smells terribly at night. It's really, really horrible. So I have these candles and incense that I just light every night. And then I got this. I got the American flag, of course. And then this is a little picture from my host sister, Arlette, who is not here right now. And that's pretty much it. Life in Simbal. Got nothing else for you. Hey, you know everybody's talking about to get out. Get out, just like MTV Cribs. Get out.